Welcome to another majorly exciting five minute auto pairing. Uh, so 2298 and FM Colstad. Let's try maybe a Panko Gambit. That's sometimes quite fun. So let me take on C4. I should get some B file play, I hope. So knight b6. I'll maybe try and get a bishop on a6 if the bishop moves off. So a5 and bishop a6 at some point. Ah, oh, okay, change the plan. Maybe e6. Try and keep an eye on e5. Uh, a6 here. Well, I've got a chance. So C4 is interesting, potentially. That knight here to here to B5 later. It's a kind of classic plan. Let him play A5 because it kind of weakens B5. Uh, it's a tempo gain. But maybe you know knight C7, knight A7, and use that B5 square. Mm. I suppose E5, knight D5, but he's on E7. It's a bit dangerous. Um, knight a7 to b5, that's an interesting concept. Maybe rookie 8 to e5, it's not too too scary, I hope. He's got to open up this bishop again. Uh, he's got knight e4 there on c5. Doesn't just win the pawn? Okay, I take this to try and keep the diagonal open. It gives me the F file as well. So knight b5 here. Try and get to play knight d4 and rook f8. Hopefully with a bit of counterplay. <clears throat> this bishop's good. This bishop's good. Uh, although knight c5 is now threatened, so knight d4. Maybe c takes. Uh, so I've got d5 on the cards. Oh, but both bishops are quite good. It's like a hyper modern strategy. He's like center. I don't know, he's come through with his center, but it's a, potentially a bit fragile. Bishops are quite good. D5, there's knight C5. I was like just taking and then D5, then I just win a piece. Looks pretty good. It's double pawns as well, gets rid of my double pawn at the same time. There's a check. Oh, I suppose that's a bit check. dangerous. Um, if I just take that, is it a big deal? I don't want now h6. Let's take this. My is rook. It's not coming in. It's rook on e3 though. It's coming in. Okay, a bit of fun here. Um, rook f8. We'll just take oh, h6. This rook a3 is d3. So maybe h6 and then g5. We're just taking in an h6. It's d3 on rook a3. Alright, so we'll just take. Alright, so qu queen d5, is that possible? Bishop e7, is there something on the g file? Well, there's knight e6 there. Knight e6. It's going to be looking fun. Will there bishop f6? 
What about just queen e6? I want his bishop after. So it's sort of simplifies bishops. I'll protect the pawn. I've got these huge pawns. He moves the bishop. I'll play rook c8. Then c3. We'll just c3. So I'll just play rook c8 for a moment. And now maybe d4 for knight d4. And then b2 as well. And I can just take that. There's d2 if uh, he's not careful. Well, knight d4 here takes, takes, takes on there. d2 takes on d4. There's rook e1. Yeah, I think this rookie one and d2 is too strong. Well, d2. Oh no, he hasn't got time. Oh, just knight c2 or d2. We're just taking the knight c2. Um, d2, rook moves. Knight c2 threatens uh, that, that king's not that safe. <clears throat> so he moves his rook. What about d2 there? If he takes, then there's rook e1. With rook c2, though, then he's won the piece. So he's waiting for a d2 blunder, there's rook c2, and that'll be a pain. D2, rook C2. I'll try and double on E1 if I play rook E5 or rook E4. Rook E4. It's not rook C2 or anything. So let's play rook E8 after for rook E1. Alright, so rook E1 now is threatened. Yeah, it's resigned here. Okay, that was that was a fun one. Yes, I enjoyed that. Sort of, my cold's a bit less than the few, last few days, so I felt a bit better with the commentary and everything. It's uh, so yeah. I thought the use of b5 here gets the d4. I didn't mind this. It's got this. I want this f file pressure. Yeah, it's immediately losing a piece, bishop e4. So he should have played... Uh, actually, black's better here already. Black's better even there. So the engine likes this for black as well. Oh, knight f6? What's this, knight f6? Check. Oh, ho, ho, ho. oh wow, what a tactic for, for e7. Check. It's not forced to play bishop takes f6 though, but uh, it's not good for me apparently. You can take on d4. Hold on, so this tactic, when did this happen? So it takes here, so he has got this dynamic tactical thing. So knight f6. So apparently this is a blunder. I should have played queen c8 to be better here. Queen c8 gets out of the way. You know what I mean? That diagonal. Um, well, so knight f6 check. Interesting. But no, he just loses a piece here. Check. It's not too hard after. I think taking was okay. Yeah, the engine likes it. If I played h6, it's not a disaster either. Um, yeah, this is, I don't think there's anything much after that. Okay, comments or questions on YouTube? Thanks very much.